In May, we went to the hotel Le Presqu'île Island Resort and Spa in Mauritius for two nights on an all-inclusive basis. Here's a review of this amazing four-star hotel. It is located in the southeast of Mauritius, very close to the airport, and so if you're looking for a quick getaway with very limited time in Mauritius, that could be a good spot for you. But let's have a look at the overall hotel experience and then you can make a better decision for yourself. We'll touch on the room, food, activities, services, and the hotel as a whole. The hotel itself was recently renovated and this is evidently seen in the room design. It is really spacious and here's how the superior room looks like. You will definitely feel the space and there are lots of storage area too. The superior room doesn't come with any bathtub, only the prestige room comes with it, which is at a higher cost of course. There are also the garden view and the sea view rooms and if you happen to go there, the sea view will be very much worth it. If you get the normal one, try asking for an upgrade at the check-in. By the way, if you want to book this hotel, check out the link in the description box for the best prices. There are three restaurants on the property. The Rendezvous restaurant is where your day would normally start, with a buffet breakfast. You can also opt for lunch and dinner there in buffet style. We had lunch and dinner there mostly. The food was good though I was not super impressed by it. I felt that it lacked some variety and it was mainly Mauritian cuisine. Now Mauritian cuisine is fine but I felt that the food was repetitive from buffet to buffet. There is also a tea break at around 4 pm where you can get some light finger food. On the second night, we tried the à la carte restaurant which is Mosaic. That was a good break from the usual buffet and we ordered special prawns which was nice too. That said, overall it was just okay in my opinion, nothing too extra. There is also the 1810 restaurant as well which gives a very nice view over the ocean. It is mainly seafood there and it is also an a la carte restaurant. But if you love seafood and you love a view, that might be a good restaurant to eat at. By the way, if you need more Mauritius insider tips, make sure to grab our free 101 Mauritius travel guide for your next trip to Mauritius. It will definitely come in handy. And if you're new to this channel, do consider subscribing as we explore Mauritius and the world together from a millennial's perspective. In terms of activities, there is a wide range of exciting water activities, including pedal boat, dive center, water ski, windsurfing and stand-up paddle. We went for snorkeling and that was a good fun. Apart from that, it was mainly a time of relaxation at the hotel, uh, staying by the swimming pool and just enjoy each other's company. We walked around the premises and relaxed by the beach mainly and with the many lounge chairs around, you definitely would want to sit back and enjoy the ocean views. There are two swimming pools, one which is nearer to the lobby and a smaller quieter one in between building blocks. It's always refreshing to catch a swim in the morning. At night, medley bar would pump the music up and there would be dancing and singing and that is pretty fun too. And that brings up the atmosphere nicely. In terms of service, it was okay. I'm not super impressed, but it was okay. The service was a bit slower at the bar, but it was understandable as there were lots of people on that day. Usually when I go to a hotel, if there was an outstanding service, I would surely remember the staff faces or their names even, but I did not have that feeling at the Presqu'île, to be honest. That said, nothing to complain as well. In terms of hotel overall, I really love the design, the decor, the overall feeling of the hotel, that was pretty good. It really gives a nice vibe for a nice little motion getaway. And I really love the numerous seatings you can find around the hotel. Definitely you will feel the space, it's very spacious. There's also the Bagno Spa on the hotel premises and it was super relaxing to catch a massage towards the end of our stay. We did ours on the last day after the checkout and it was just what we needed before we hit the Monday routines. That was definitely ending our stay on a good note and I'm pretty sure you will enjoy a nice break at the spa too. All in all, the hotel was beautiful, the stay was a good one with our friends, 
Definitely I would have wanted something more special in terms of food, but it was good enough. I don't have anything much to complain. I hope that you've enjoyed this Presqu'Isle Island Resort review on your end and that it helped you make a decision of whether to go there or not. Thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next video. Until then, make sure you like this video and subscribe for more videos. Cheers, goodbye.